In this playlist, we're going to go ahead and delve into the complex topic of working with permissions and folders in Panopto. This is a little bit different than some of the previous tutorials maybe you've seen that we've done. This one's going to specifically look at how to share content between courses and also how to move content between courses. I'm going to go ahead and demonstrate this both in the original and ultra version just in terms of access. But I do want you to keep in mind that once you're inside Panopto, the tool works essentially the same way. So it's just where it is in the original view and the ultra view that's a little bit different. I'm going to go ahead and begin here by demonstrating the courses. And I'll go ahead and I will start inside a sandbox for demonstration. This sandbox is going to be in the Blackboard original view, which most of the viewers will be familiar with. When I open up my sandbox, um, some things that you want to make note of, I'm going to go in my menu bar and I'm going to scroll all the way down and notice that I have kept the uh, course application tool here. If you're going to be moving a lot of content between courses or trying to merge folders, instead of adding uh, and replacing the course application tool with the tool link, you might just choose to opt to keep the course application tool. I'll go ahead and I'll select this course application tool and remember that this is my path into Panopto as an instructor. We want to keep this hidden from our students. So let's go ahead and select this. When I select this, notice that the Panopto um, tool link opens up here. And the real difference with the course application tool is that you do have this reconfigure button at the bottom, and you don't have that in the regular tool. One way that uh, you can move content is to select this reconfigure tool and this will give you a list of all possible folders that you are assigned to and allow you to merge folders together. This works in some cases but there's a better way to manage your folder structure and before we delve into this I do want to show you the better way to do that. So I'm going to select cancel for now and I'm going to go ahead and show you that instead of viewing your Panopto folder structure inside of Blackboard, like I'm doing in this example, you'll notice that I have a folder here. And inside that folder, I have a list of folders at the top and the bottom. But a better way to manage this and the video contents that are inside of this is to come over on the right-hand side. And on the right-hand side, I'm actually going to select this open in Panopto button. And this is going to take us out of Blackboard momentarily and open Panopto in a different browser tab. Let's try this. Notice now that Panopto has opened in an additional browser tab. And I'll go ahead and I will navigate between these different folders just so you can see that there is different content in each one of these folders here. Okay. The next thing I want to do is demonstrate the exact same thing, but I want to show this for our Ultra viewers in Ultra. So let me show you how you can access that the same way. First thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and close this browser tab, and I'm going to leave my Blackboard original course here. And for those that are working in Ultra, we're going to demonstrate this in the Ultra environment. So I'm going to open a sandbox in Ultra. And my Ultra users know that this is a little bit different looking. So we're going to navigate like we've been doing to the bottom in Ultra because we can't put this in the sidebar. And when you get to the bottom, remember you're going to access your course tool in Panopto from the bottom of your page. And again, this is provided that you've set all these tools up in advance. When we select that, you'll notice very similar to the original view that the sandbox um, Panopto player opens up here. And I can choose between my folders 
this way. But just as I showed you before, to get maybe a little bit more control over managing videos and folders, I'm going to do just what I did before. I'm going to navigate over to the right hand side and I'm going to select once again this open in Panopto tool. And by doing that, we'll once again have an additional browser tab. This additional browser tab is going to actually allow me to have a little bit more flexibility uh, when I'm moving content around and, and examining uh, my permissions. So notice that if I toggle between these, here's my Blackboard view of this. Here's my Panopto view of this. The easiest way to know if you're in the Panopto view, notice that there is no Panopto icon in the upper left-hand corner. But notice that there is the Panopto icon in the upper left-hand corner in this version. In the upcoming videos on this, we're going to look at now the folder structure and how to manage this. But this is just to get you started to see how to get to the different folders. I hope that you found this tutorial useful. For more information, please visit us at the Faculty Center for the Advancement of Teaching and Learning, and please be sure to continue along with this playlist.